Well, she's painted. Doug got a wild hair yesterday and decided to come in and paint it. It looks dang good from here. That's good. It's Monday night about five o'clock. We're cleaning up stage. Um, tomorrow night we'll be going to Darren's to hopefully fire up the big horse, get that motor project all buttoned up. I know he was working on it over the weekend. Uh, I think it's fenders, hood, and nose. Put some shocks and springs on it set up and move some lead around and I think she's ready to go too. Two weeks. I came to Dallas well, be pulling it off. Oh. And, I, and I waited two hours after I painted it. down here for a second. Is that a winner? Yeah, that's a winner. That's a winner. I like that too. Yeah. Check that out, Jason. I stopped there. Look at here. Mm-hmm. You can shave by that. Yeah. Get a shot on it. Is that wax or is that? Huh? Is that wax? It's a new finish. That, new finish. that should be fine on that, I would think. Yeah. Huh? I would think that would, as long as it's wax, it'd be fine on that. I just don't want to get, get it too hot or loose some decal on it. Yeah, I wouldn't. This shine right up compared to what's at the top. I don't know if you can see it on camera or not, but definitely looks 100% better. Really 
hitting her with a light coat of uh, barkeeper's friend. Yeah, taking all the marks and the rust mark, uh, drain, whatever you call that. Yeah. Water, water stains. Water stains, yeah. We went from rust drains down to water. <laughs> yeah. I don't want to get on this new paint. So no, 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 no. It ain't hard enough yet. I got to stay away from it. Man, that red just pops. Front of this trailer looked really good with that. Yeah. Jack carried uh -huh. in, carried into it. You know what I mean? What's that? If the red was on the back? Oh, oh I know. I, I we want it, but Darren's got to talk to his brother-in-law or aggressive. He didn't do it yet. Look at that. <whistles> you see it down there? No, I can't. It's shining really good. Uh, I can now. I didn't even do nothing to yeah. it other than the bars keeper. I yeah. didn't put any polish or anything on it. Well, we've made it to Darren's. Beautiful evening. About 77 degrees. Chance tornadoes tonight. I got told I got to cook dinner. I'll go prep them. Uh, heats up. Getting closer. Getting closer. New bumper. We picked up the nose at Randy's, so that can go on. Fit in the gas pedal. Yeah. Money? Yeah. Money. Where you want it at? I just put it even with the spline. Actually, right, right there is fine. Right. I could have sworn you pulled that spring out of that box bag the other one for that reason. What spring? Ignition can go in for a final then. What? Oh yeah. So what is that? Probably six inches. Yeah. Add to it. Mm -hmm. And then to a straight and a straight. Yeah, that's what I put down here and then come straight out to here just like you did. Okay, so two straights and six inches longer than that. Yeah. Well, we need to call Max to see if he can come grab this or I'll can run to him tonight when everybody leaves. Got deer brats cooking. She's only 350. She good. I I've actually hit the 425 on the set I got on though. Mm -hmm. That's why I don't like cooking with gas. Mm -hmm. And that's why I said the six would be. It's five. It's okay there. to curl it and give us some room to talk. We don't call you Impact Dave for nothing. Oh, fuck, I got it now. He got it. Three hours later. Is there a big in there? No. A half inch? Yeah. No. No, no half inch in here. No, you Checking the J bar. Hold it like that. 
set where it's going to run. I need to tighten it. It's going to have to go clock it. I got to clock it a little bit. TikTok sucks. Uh, it's no, I need a pair of pliers or something. Well, here, clock it. Right there. He's actually Yeah. Hold it myself. I actually think it's worth it. Okay. <laughs> I'm in the oil system. I just filled her up. We're 10, 20, 30, 40, 40. 39. Which one? Hose that comes to the cooler to the front. That one that had that bad spot in it. There's some under the bench over here. Under the bench. Over, the, over there, there's Yeah. Well, here was the bad spot. Wait, there's a bad spot in that part where I just had it. You can see it. Yeah. Well, it's Saturday morning, March 2nd, two weeks till race day, got Formula One race on, and they're waxing and polishing, never ending. Got a lot of rock chips in it. Ain't nothing I can do about them. Well, got her turned around. George is cleaning the wrap, shining it up. Doug's buffing up there. 
I got the bumper polished. Now I've got a coat of wax on it. That and the bug guard. Next thing's gonna be the sun visor and the stainless panel up there. See if we can make it look a little better. Once this side of the truck is done, the truck is done. Then it's on to the trailer. Two weeks from today, we'll be loaded up and headed to the track, hopefully, weather pending. Um, supposed to be in the low 70s today and 80 tomorrow. So the weather's looking nice, but then rain all week. Of course, we could use the rain. She's shining up quite nicely. Also, don't forget, we have our blue t-shirts and hoodies from last year, sand colored t-shirts from last year. We got our new leather patch hats in black and olive. We also have our tin hats and snapback, flex fit, small, medium, and large, extra large. You can check that out on the website. The link is just in the description. Also, DarrenKleinRacing.com. Well, Rattle Can Ricky's turned into Paintbrush Pete today. He painted where the ramps set. The bottom sides of the ramps, they were rusted. They were rusty. Yes, they were. That looks a lot nicer, though. And we run into some issues with this. I'm going back over it with cutting compound. It, I don't know if the video shows it, but it is splotchy as all get out with what Doug was using. So I'm coming back with the chemical guys, redoing the whole thing. Which sucks, running a four inch or six inch buffer. Uh, flat wears you out. Yeah, that looks a lot. I've got it about half done. Well, this side's completely buffed. My arms are jello, but it definitely looks a thousand percent better than what it was. Just needs to be wiped down and have a coat of wax put on it. And that will be good. It's about 4.40 Saturday afternoon. You may be able to just take a rag and wipe it and be fine. I don't know. Absolutely love the front end of this truck. That bumper and brow sets it off. It looks like it's putting the two windows and now it's That's a savings of ten dollars a month. Plus, get a select phone on us and a $100 Verizon gift card when you switch. Well, there's never been a better time to switch to the network America Reliza. We could always pull that other truck up and back up. And save big today. Minimum $599.99 up to $699. Well, I'm saying, let's go ahead and finish this guy. Yeah, we're done. Yeah, we're done. Yeah, good Sunday morning to you. It's about noon. Doug and I have been here for an hour. The truck pulled out, draining the RV antifreeze out of it. Going to fill the water tank up, first fill up of the year. Got this side done and waxed, and she is shining like a new penny in the sun. Back the truck out. Our windshield washer pump motor popped out and drained all the windshield washer fluid. Now, I don't know if you can see this side. This side looks horrible. So I'm gonna get to buff this entire side too. They used, they tried just waxing it and that didn't cut it. It looks like hell. I don't know if you can see all the haze in the camera or not, but it looks horrible, not to our standards. So I'm gonna to get to redo that one.
good times. It's uh, 70 degrees here at noon on Sunday, so the weather is awesome. It's supposed to rain Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Hopefully we can get some good weather closer to race day. We're ready to go. Well, I got this side done from the windows up and I just got to do the windows down. It's 3.30 on Sunday. I'm calling it a day. I will finish the windows down tomorrow. Get that project done, put a coat of wax on it, and then the toter is done. I think George and Doug are going to start waxing the trailer. That's what's going to happen tomorrow night. Tuesday night we are going to Darren's, hopefully to fire the car up uh, and button it up. Less than two weeks to go. Thanks for watching. Hope you're enjoying the content. If you are, hit that thumbs up button. Uh, drop us a comment. If you're not a subscriber, you can do so by hitting a picture of Darren's race car in the lower right-hand corner. We will catch you all next week.